loves me. Yes, yes, she does. Come on. She got the way to move me, Shelly. She got the way to groove me. I've decided to go away for the summer. This makes Sam nervous. He thinks I'm leaving because last night he proposed to me. So he'll come pick me up in September? Maybe. Maybe not. But how do we even know if we're only supposed to be with one person for the rest of our lives? For as long as I can remember, my grandmother and her friends have been part of a quilting bee. Is this something you're making for the state fair? It's your wedding quilt, honey. Why can't we love as many people as we want in a lifetime? What's your name? I mean, monogamy is really a very unnatural state. I brought these for you. Have you been talking to your fiance about any of this? You're getting cold feet. I can see that same look your mother gets when she's gonna dump one of her boyfriends. Oh, that look. I never liked fool. They give people an excuse to do foolish things. I'm young. I'm supposed to do foolish things. There comes a time in every life... I'm engaged to be married. So you just want a friendship thing? When planning for the future... That which is forbidden... means looking at the past. Young lovers seek perfection. Old lovers learn the art of sewing shreds together and of seeing beauty in a multiplicity of patches. Universal Pictures and Amblin Entertainment proudly present the story of a young woman whose eyes are about to be opened. Sometimes I wonder how exactly I got here. By the women who've seen it all. All right, let me ask you this. If you had to choose between marrying a lover or marrying a friend, who would you choose? Winona Ryder, Ellen Burstyn, Anne Bancroft, Alfred Woodard, and Kate Nelligan in a film by Jocelyn Morehouse, How to Make an American Quilt.